Hey guys, an everyday Canadian, and today we're making red pepper chicken. Well, red pepper beer chicken. We're gonna be using some Coors Light. We're gonna have some corn on the cob, red bell pepper, and some chicken legs that we picked up for five bucks. Five pieces of chicken, not bad. Um, what we're gonna do is dethaw this chicken. Um, whatever we don't use, we'll just freezer that and. Uh, yeah, we'll get this started and marinate it in some beer and some barbecue sauce. Let's get started. All right, guys, why our uh, chicken is uh, de-thawing, we're just going to cut up some peppers right here. Probably do a crappy job right here, but it's all going to be diced up anyways. Get that core out there. I really don't care about the seeds. So, uh, the seeds are fine. Get this all chopped up for a red beer chicken. Make sure it's all nice and chopped up. Doesn't have to be perfect. You know, I gotta do this quick. Just me cooking tonight. So you guys are stuck with me. So we'll get those all nice, decent chunks. Nice, decent chunks. Want some good bite size. Manly bite size. There we go. Get all that nice and chopped. So once we get that chopped, we'll put that aside and we'll uh, get our chicken ready. All right, guys. Now that we got our chicken dethawed, got some nice chicken legs here. Real good size. Um, picked them up for uh, five pieces for uh, five bucks. We got these uh, Ziploc bags. We're just going to marinate everything. I was going to do this video tonight, but uh, the girlfriend wanted pizza tonight. Can you believe it? So we're going to marinate this in beer and some barbecue sauce and some peppers and some green onions we got from the garden. And uh, yeah, we're going to marinate this overnight. So uh, what we're going to first we're going to do is just uh, open our bags right here. Grab uh, some chicken leg right here, nice chicken leg. Put that in our Ziploc bag. Wonder how many we can actually get in that Ziploc bag. All right, so we can do two, all right? So what you guys are gonna wanna do is uh, just add some peppers to it. It's okay, so we want that flavor. Just give it a good tap down. So our chicken and some peppers, just gonna do a couple at a time. Just tap that down. Um, crack our beer. Now, I have children. I can't be putting beer in their chicken. Tasha doesn't want any because she doesn't want any. Well, she doesn't want any. So, oh, you're fine. You can never do a video when you got children or when your phone's ringing constantly. Oh, I'll be there in a minute, buddy. So, we're using Coors Light. Alright, guys, sorry. Just give me a second. All right, guys, uh, so we're back. <laughs> Sorry about that. So we got our chicken and our peppers inside our bag right here, just a normal Ziploc bag. And what we're going to do is we're going to add uh, some Coors Light. You guys can use any beer you want. I'm just using Coors Light. It's something that I drink, I enjoy. I don't buy none of that cheap shit. So we're just going to fill that up. Get that all nice and mixed. Put our beer in there. We're going to let this sit overnight. We're going to add some, uh, we're going to put that in a bowl just to hold it up. So get the camera over here a little bit for you guys. We're going to add some barbecue sauce. I'm using uh, chicken and rib. You guys can use any barbecue sauce you want. So we're just going to get that in there. Alright, give that a good splash. And well, I like heat. I like a little bit of heat, so I'm using some Frank's Red Hot. So just give that a couple splashes. Me, yeah, I really like spicy food. And uh, whatever beer you don't finish inside the bag, well, you can just drink, right? So uh, we'll get this sealed up inside here. I'm just gonna zip this up if we can. It's kind of slippery. Make sure it's sealed. Make sure you guys wash your hands because you don't want to get any sickness from the chicken, raw chicken. That all good. So what I'll do is uh, actually, you know what? I forgot. 
got the green onions that I got from the garden. So we're going to take some uh, chives out for some color. Just open, reopen that again. Sorry about this video guys, should have had it all prepped. Girlfriend's gone to the pizza place to go get some pizzas. So just grab, you know, a good handful or whatever and just throw some uh, green onions in there. And uh, ziplock this back up. Alright, so we got our uh, red peppers, some barbecue sauce, some Frank's Red Hot in there, our beer, our Coors Light, some green onions, sorry if I repeated myself, and our chicken leg. So we're just going to mix that up after, let that sit overnight, and get that on for tomorrow, and I'll show you what these uh, look like when they're all done. Alright guys, I'll get back to you. Hey guys, once we uh, cleaned up all our mess, we're left with these uh, chicken legs with the red peppers, green onions, and some barbecue sauce, some Frank's Red Hot. Um, this is mine. This has got the Coors Light beer in it. So I'm going to let that uh, marinate overnight. And uh, we'll pick this back up. Um, whatever beer you're left over with, you just, you know, have a good drink. So, uh, yes, this is our uh, red pepper beer chicken. Hope you guys enjoy. I will see you tomorrow when we cook this up. All right, guys. All right, guys. So our uh, chicken's been sitting overnight, marinating. This is our red uh, pepper beer chicken. I only did it to the one because, well, we got kids and my girlfriend eating. She doesn't want any of that. Uh, we went ahead and cleaned our corn, so we're going to pop that in the water, get that all ready. Um, we're also going to be um, getting our pot ready. So we get that ready, put that over there. A nice roasting pan right here. We want to keep all the juices inside of a pan. Um, the thing about uh, beer is that it'll evaporate and it'll reduce, so you don't have to worry about anything or anything bad happening. So this is our red pepper chicken. Nice chicken sizes chicken legs. Get that out. Now it's been marinating for probably 16 hours. This was overnight so we just want to get all that juices, those nice flavors. Put that like that, flip them all upright. You guys can put uh, whatever seasonings, whatever barbecue sauce you want on it. I'm going to be putting a little bit of vegetable seasoning on that because I love vegetable seasoning. Got one more right here. This stuff smells so good right now. I just want to dig in right now. I'm so hungry. Yes, lots of flavor. So we're gonna grab uh, some. Oh, wrong seasoning. We're gonna grab some of our clubhouse uh, vegetable seasoning right here. Give it a good sprinkle. Coat everything. Now if you guys want, halfway through it, you can put some more barbecue sauce. This smells unbelievable right now, guys. Get a good shot of that. So the next thing you guys are going to want to do is turn your oven on to 400. And we'll just go 400. Get that preheated, get our corn on, and uh, yeah, we'll uh, see you when this uh, preheats. Alright guys, so once our oven's hit 400 degrees, we're just going to put our chicken in the oven, in our roasting pan. Put that in. We're going to turn our corn on. No, not yet. Oh, oh put the time on. So an hour and a half, put our corn on, make sure it's on the right setting, and uh, we'll let this uh, cook. That's so cool. <laughs> so this is the uh, red pepper beer chicken with Coors Light. And we'll be back when it is almost done. All right, guys. So uh, the uh, chicken is done. We're gonna pull this out of the oven now. Oh, let me close it. 
nice golden skin. No, it's not burnt. Just kidding. So we're gonna get this out. We're just gonna let this sit out for a minute. We're gonna get this plated. Corn's almost done. So you want to get a good shot of that uh, red pepper beer chicken. This was marinated in beer. Uh, just the one chicken was because Tasha didn't want any and well I can't give the kids beer, right? So this has got red peppers in it, barbecue sauce in it. I put also some Frank's Red Hot in it and some green onions for chives. Some decoration. We'll get this plated, make it look nice, wait for the corn. And we'll show you what it looks like when it's plated. Alright. Alright guys, so we just finished plating this. We're having corn on the cob. You guys are more than welcome to have mixed vegetables or potatoes, whatever you want on the side. This is just what I want. So this is our red pepper beer chicken. Smells so good right now. If you guys want to see more cooking videos, everyday Canadian stuff, please like, comment, subscribe. This is an everyday Canadian. Take care guys.